Hey everybody, so I just wanted to talk to you real quick about uh, the importance of humidity and how it affects your floor long term. So let's take a look and show you a little bit of what I'm talking about. So you want to keep your humidity around 35 to 50% all year round. And here's one of the reasons why. Your floor will stay flatter the more consistent you keep the relative humidity in the house. Now, this floor, we are sanding. It's hickory. There's a lot of movement just because of hickory and its nature. And I'm going to show you how much more flooring has to be removed to get it flat, just due to the fact that the humidity uh, is pretty extreme. One, it's situational here just because it's on the water. Um, and then to having like an April air system or something like that is also greatly going to help keep that um, relative humidity in the house more consistent. So you can see how you got these lines where they're round. That's because it uh, has crowned. And some of that is due to um, possibly water leaking and different stuff like that. But you can see how much more flooring has to be removed just due to the fact that the relative humidity in the house and, and temperature play a big part in this in keeping it flat. And it's not flat, but we need to get it flat. And then once it's sanded flat, um, then it's up to the homeowner to or client to make sure that you know relative humidity is in check you can kind of see how the floor has a little bit of uh, cupping and movement some of that is just normal it is hardwood uh, and you are going to have movement but there are things like i mentioned that you can do so just a couple tips keep that humidity between 35 and 50 percent all year round um, using April air in the winter time to keep that humidity um, up. And then in the summertime, run your AC, have a hygrometer inside the house. That helps out a lot. And uh, those are just a couple of tips to uh, keeping your floor looking great.